Warm welcome to an yet another discussion on gate electronics and communication network related papers. So here we are checking gate 2014 set 1. Right. Basically there are four sets during 2014 electronics and communication gate paper. Here I am checking the first one. So moving to the first question. Consider the configuration shown in the figure which is a portion of a larger electrical network. For R equal to 1 ohm and currents I1 equal to 2 ampere, right current I1 equal to 2 ampere, I4 equal to minus 1 ampere, I5, I5 equal to minus 4 ampere, which one of the following is true? So here we can apply Kirchhoff's current law at all three nodes, first node, second node and third node. So checking at first node, that is this node I5, right I5 is entering. Similarly, I2 is also entering. So, I5 plus I2 equal to I3. Equation 1. Similarly, at the second node, I3 plus I6 equal to I1. Right? Equation 2. Similarly, at third node, I4 plus I1 equal to I2. Equation 3. Here in the question, we have given I1 equal to 2 ampere. Right? I1 equal to 2 ampere. I4 equal to minus 1 ampere and I5 equal to minus 4 ampere. So, so there are 6 variables I1, I2, I3, I4, I5 and I6 and here it is given I1 equal to 2 ampere, I4 equal to minus 1 and I5 equal to minus 4 ampere. That means there are 3 equations and 3 unknowns. So, definitely we can solve it. So, now checking third equation that is I4 plus I1 equal to I2. I4 is given as minus 1. So, minus 1 plus I1 is given as 2, right, equal to I2. So, I2 turns out to be 1 ampere. So, I am marking here I2 equal to 1 ampere. Now, checking equation 1, I5 plus I2 equal to I3. So, I5 is given as minus 4. So, minus 4 plus I2 is 1 ampere equal to I3. So, I3 turns out to be minus 3 ampere right so now checking equation 2 i3 plus i6 equal to i1 i3 turns out to be minus 3 and uh, we have to evaluate i6 so i3 minus i1 i1 equal to 2 ampere so minus 3 minus 2 equal to minus 6 minus i6 that is i6 equal to 5 ampere so now checking the options which one of the following is true? So I6 equal to 5 ampere is correct. I3 equal to minus 4 ampere is incorrect. I3 is actually minus 3 ampere. So the answer is A. Moving to the next question. A two-port network has scattering parameters given by S equal to S11, S12, S21, S22. If the port 2 of the two-port is short-circuited, the S11 parameter for the resultant one-port network is. Right? So, I am drawing a two port network with a yes parameters. So, this is a two port network. I am marking the voltages as A1, similarly A2, similarly B1, similarly B2. Right? Now, we know B1 equal to S11 A1 plus S12 A2. And similarly, B2 equal to S21 A1 plus S22 A2. Here, in the question, it is mentioned as the, the port 2 is short-circuited. Right? Port 2 is short-circuited. That means A2 equal to B2. Right? A2 equal to B2 as port 2 2 dash is short-circuited. Now, checking the options. Options are given in terms of S parameters. Right? So, we have to calculate individual S parameters. That is, we can first calculate S11. S11 equal to B1 by A1 at A2 equal to 0. Right. Similarly, next one, S12 equal to B1 by A2 at A1 equal to 0. Similarly, next one, S21 equal to B2 by A1 at A2 equal to 0. But here, 
ए टू ईक्वल टू बी टू आस ए टू ईक्वल टू सीरो बी टू ईक्वल टू सीरो सो एस टू वन स्टैंड औट टू बी सीरो सिमिलरली एस टू टू ईक्वल टू बी टू बै ए टू रईट अट ए वण ईक्वल टू सीरो अगेन बी टू ईक्वल टू ए टू इंप्ले एस टू टू ईक्वल टू वण रईट एस टू टू ईक्वल टू वण आज एस टू वण ईक्वल टू सीरो नौ चेकिंग द ऑप्शन फस्ट ऑप्शन एस वण वण माइनस एस वण वण एस टू टू प्लस एस वण टू एस टू वण सो एस वण टू एस टू वण ईस सीरो दिस टेम टर्न सो टू बी सीरो एंड दिस ईस एस वण वण दैट ईस ईक्वल टू एस वण वण इन टू वण माइनस एस टू टू रईट सो एस वण वण इंटू वण माइनस एस टू टू बट एस टू टू ईक्वल टू वण दैट ईस दिस टेम ए ईक्वल टू सीरो हियर इट ईस मार्क डास् एस वण वण ईक्वल टू सीरो सो इट ईस नोट दैट वे एस वण वण ईक्वल टू आक्चुअली बी वण बै ए वण सो ए ईस नोट एन आंसर सिमिलरली चेकिंग ऑप्शन बी एस वण वण ई एम टेकिंग कॉमन एस वण वण इंटू वण प्लस एस टू टू वण प्लस एस टू टू ईस टू रईट आस एस टू टू ईक्वल टू वण सो एस वण वण इंटू टू माइनस एस वण टू इंटू एस टू वण एस टू वण ईस सीरो सो सीरो डिवेडड बै वण प्लस एस टू टू एस टू टू ईस अगेन वण सो टू टू कैंसल सो दिस मस्ट बी द आंसर टू रईट अगेन वी कैन चेक ऑप्शन सी और ऑप्शन डी चेकिंग ऑप्शन डी बिकॉज इट ईस सिमिलर टू ऑप्शन बी दैट ईस एस वण वण इंटू वण माइनस एस टू टू सो दैट टेन सो टू बी सीरो प्लस एस वण टू इंटू एस टू वण दैट टेन अगेन टू बी सीरो सो द न्यूमरेटर ईस सीरो सो ऑप्शन डी ईस नोट ए वालिड आंसर सिमिलरली चेकिंग एट दिस ऑप्शन एस वण वण ई एम टेकिंग कॉमन अगेन एस वण वण इंटू वण प्लस एस टू टू दैट ईस टू प्लस सीरो डिवेडड बै वण माइनस एस टू टू ईस वण सो दैट ईस सीरो सो इट टेन सो टू बी S one two S one one by zero. That is infinity. So, so it is not the answer. Now, answer is B. Moving to a two more question. A Y network, right? A star network has a resistance of ten ohm each in two of its arms, while the third arm has a resistance of eleven ohm, right? So here it is eleven, ten, ten. In the equivalent delta network, the lowest value among the three resistances are. right so in the equivalent delta network so i am plotting the equivalent delta network we have to find the lowest value of three resistance from y network to delta network conversion we know the numerator part is say that is 10 into 10 right this resistance into this resistance 10 into 10 plus again 10 into 11 plus 10 into 11 right or 11 into 10 divided by opposite resistance so here it is mentioned as in the equivalent delta network we have to evaluate the lowest value among the three resistance the lowest value happens when we evaluate this resistance right as it is divided by 11 but all other cases it is divided by 10 we can take 10 common from numerator so 10 plus 11 plus 11 right divided by 11 so that is 10 plus 20, 320, right? 320 by 11, so that is 29.090. So that is the answer. Anyway, we can check other options too. That is, when we evaluate this resistance, numerator part remains same. That is 320 divided by denominator side it is 10, so that is 32. Similarly, checking the other resistance too, it is 32. So the lowest one is 29.090. Moving to the next two more question, a 230 volt armor source supplies power to two loads connected in parallel, right? A 230 volt AC is there, and it supplies power to two loads connected in parallel. The first load draws 10 kilowatt at a point at leading power factor, right? And the second one draws 10 kilovolt ampere at a point eight lagging power factor right so the second load at point eight lagging power factor at 10 kva so the second one draws 10 kva at a point eight lagging power factor but the first one draws 10 kilowatt at a point eight leading power factor too 
and we have to calculate the complex power delivered by the source right so it is mentioned as the first load draws 10 kilowatt so for load 1 i am writing it for load 1 p that is power equal to 10 kilowatt and it is given as cos phi cos phi is given as 0.8 leading power factor so cos phi equal to 0 0.8 from that we can calculate phi, phi equal to cos inverse 0.8 that is 36.869 degrees. Right. Now we can evaluate tan phi, tan phi equal to tan 36.869 degree equal to 0 0.75. Right. Now we can calculate q, q equal to p tan phi. Right. So here it is given P as 10, tan phi is 0.75, so Q equal to 7.5. So the complex power taken by the first load is 10 minus J 7.5. So I am marking it as S1. Now we can calculate for load 2. Again for load 2, cos phi equal to 0.8 and cos phi we can note it as cos phi equal to p by s the second one draws 10 kva power so s is given so right so s is given as 10 and we can calculate p from that that is p by 10 equal to cos phi cos phi is 0.8 so p by 10 equal to 0.8 from that p equal to 8 right now that is p equal to 8 kilowatt unit of p is kilowatt and the unit of q is kilowatt ampere right so s2 equal to p plus j q that is 8 plus j q for that q equal to again q equal to p tan phi so that is 8 tan phi tan phi is evaluated as point 75 0.75 is 3 by 4 so that is 8 by 4 is 2 2 into 3 6 so 8 plus j 6 that is the complex power absorbed by the second load now the total complex power turns out to be s1 plus s2 right so that is 10 plus 8 18 minus j 7.5 plus 6 that is minus j 1.5 so this is the answer 18 minus j 1.5 kilowatt ampere so only there are four questions for gate 2014 set one for more gate tutorials subscribe my channel now i am signing out till we meet again with another gate paper thank you